Uh, a right is threefold. Ooch. Property, possession, and of possibility. <laughs> now, since we're talking about rescheduling the court hearings, the possibilities, what do I say mm -hmm, about what happens on Monday? Because I think they could actually afford, yes, well, I talked to a person. I could go to Squim for a sleep study or possibly Seattle. Yes. Or I could go on welfare and then I could provide Medicaid. Yes. And then I could say, no, <laughs> um, I'm actually scheduling a sleep study for this next week and I've got to go on welfare and po, po, po. Now, this control of the actual citizen's personal life, yeah, it really limits the possibilities of what I could be doing. Yes. When you have a total lack of reason for refusing to admit the evidence that I wasn't in Brennan, yes, a complete insanity. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, I know my public defender, oh, he wants me there on Wednesday just like he wanted me there yesterday. Yes, but he didn't want me there because he canceled the court hearing. Now, distinguishing between right and wrong conduct. Mm -hmm. There seems to be some wrong conduct on the part of police and sheriff's departments yes. that they don't want me to sue them for. Poo -poo. Let's think of the possibilities. What am I going to do as the accused? Yes. Where I email you the evidence that you have that I wasn't in Brennan and I wasn't cyber stalking. Yes. I was informing you of fraud, forgery, and misrepresentation and conspiracy and color of law violations and hate crimes and various other treasonous types of high crimes and misdemeanors. <laughs> and the possibility is that, nope, unless they schedule the sleep hearing on Monday, yeah, there's nothing I can say to the public defender that would affect uh -huh, his decision making at rescheduling it for the 18th. <laughs> Now, you would have thought as soon as a police officer called Port Townsend right now and said, we have the evidence that Paul was in Port Angeles on June 16th of 2017, yeah. sitting in front of the Masonic Temple making videos. Yes. Uploading them at the Senior Center. Yes. Emailing them at the Senior Center and at the house sitting uh -huh, where he was staying at. Pooch. In fact, we have emails that whole fucking day. Pow, pouch. Now, I know. The possibility. Oh, how much time in prison can you get? Sounds insane, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. This wrong conduct on the part of the sheriff's departments, and not just the local sheriff. Yeah, it's every sheriff's department and every deputy sheriff. Poop. Now, I'm talking about possibility today mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because we don't know how these things are going to work out, do we? No. <laughs> We do not know until the actual day and time exactly what the fuck's going to happen. I'm talking right now. 